Hello and welcome to the Paul Rose Fieldhouse on the campus of Holliston High School. Today is Tuesday, January 24th, 2023, and Holliston Cable Access Television is here covering the girls' varsity basketball action as the 6-6 six and six Holliston Lady Panthers host the 4-7 and seven Medway Mustangs. My name is Steve Hedrick, and I'm here with Jay the Legend Wyman. Jay, I think we are in for a very competitive TVL large game tonight between these two young ball clubs, each growing in experience with every game played. And of course, the Medway Holliston matchups are always full of excitement. They are full of excitement in any sport they play. These uh, these two towns next to each other, and uh, a lot of these kids know each other because when they play certain sports, they uh, sometimes play on the same teams when they're younger kids. So this should be good. This should be a good game. I think um, uh, Medway might have a little bit more offense, but I think uh, uh, Hollison plays a little bit better defense. So we'll see which which one of those ends up on top tonight. But uh, I uh, I really I'm really looking forward to this. I think the girls are looking forward to this. This would be a nice win for Hollison to move to seven or six. Um, if they can get this win tonight. So I expect to see uh, all on the floor uh, defense jumping all over the place on the floor and, and some good rebounding out of uh, Holliston. Yeah, I think Holliston has really been building the last few games. You know, their, their, their defense has really stayed steady and uh, kept them in a lot of ball games. And, and when the offense is good, then they're able to pull those games out, you know, uh, especially if they can spread the offense out a little bit. And I think that's happening. Yeah, we started to see a little bit of that the last game we did with LB getting some scoring for uh, for uh, Holliston. So, uh, you know, if we can get that and get uh, Megan Simpson um, going again and then get some stuff out of um, maybe uh, someone like Kaylee McDonald that, you know, we've been in good shape. All right, we got Kenny Priest uh, getting ready to do the... Uh, Announcements that for the starting lineups, as uh, Kenny only does. He yeah, he's uh, reading off the do's and don'ts now. <laughs> <laughs> so here we go with the Medway Mustangs. Number two, Junior Ellie Copeland. Number four, sophomore, Victoria Bullard. Number 10, captain, senior, Shannon Mejia. Number 21, sophomore, Olivia Melanson. And number uh, 33, captain, senior, Olivia Canary. Head, head coach of Medway is Joe Iannone. Not the E. With the E. With the E. With the E. <laughs> Number five, sophomore, Megan Simpson. Number 13, sophomore, Kaylee McDonald. Number 14, captain, senior, Katie Williams. Number 32, Captain Senior Caroline Brady. And number 35, Captain Senior Mia Quinzani. Head coach for uh, Holliston is Kurt Lorenzen.
Okay. Well, that's a different rendition. Of that and it brings me back to the old Boston Celtics or uh, the Red Sox and the, who was that, that uh, organ player? John Kiley. John Kiley, that's right, John Kiley. And surprising that you said that, Jay, because I talked to Kenny earlier, and that's a recording of Kenny playing his keyboard, oh, no the kidding. national anthem. Yes. Wow. He yes. is really talented. Kenny, you know, <laughs> got to talk to him someday. He's really talented. Done a lot of stuff in his life. He, he's, we are very fortunate to have him here at Holliston High School. Absolutely. He is so great in what he does and working with the kids. Um, anyway, back to basketball. Enough of Kenny. Well, here we go. So a couple, couple things, uh, coach's keys for tonight is, um, you know, to limit the turnovers and take care of the ball. We've talked about this so often how when Holliston has a lot of turnovers, they, they lose, and it, that's, there's no other way to put it. Uh, they need to rebound tonight. They've been very good rebounding team, so they need to continue to do that. Um, transition, get back on D and look to run. They've been running, and they've been doing a nice job transitioning um, both to offense and defense with a lot of speed. And finally, they need to shoot and look to score with confidence. And we talked about that the last game. That's another key that the coach wanted last week. Can you get some of that? There's a block right there. And Hollison's looking to run. Megan, uh, push it, Megan Simpson pushing the ball up. Fakes the shot, gets it over to Katie Williams. Brady with the up fake and the shot in the middle, no good. And here comes Medway. Hollison in the man-to-man -man defense. This is a defensive team, Steve, that they go they go to the floor for the ball, they'll do anything um, for the ball. Here's a oh. quick foul on Kaylee. Okay, and that's number 21 for Medway, uh, senior Olivia Melanson. Uh, with the basket and she'll shoot one shot yeah that was tough uh, Kaylee got run into a pick and couldn't get over the pick free throw is good so it ended up uh, Melanson ended up with a wide open uh, fairly wide open layup okay uh, Medway's in a man to man as well Simpson with the ball out. Oh. Now she's yep. uh, Megan and one. And one. Megan is the second leading scorer in the Tri Valley League, and she's averaging uh, just a hair under 21 points a game for Holliston. And she's been a lot of the offense uh, this year. In, in, spite of, in spite of being double teamed a and, lot, and, and sometimes more. And yeah, and sometimes more. And if you noticed, uh, the Medway girls were trying to double up on her as she was dribbling by. 3-2. Medway up by one. 7 3 left to go in the first quarter. Okay. Kaylee on the ball. It's a little pick. Good to get through. Good defense by Katie Williams. It's a runner. Ooh. He's at number 21 again. Uh... Olivia Melanson. Yeah, she's only a uh, sophomore, too. Yeah, yeah, and, uh, you know, Coach Iannone was uh, really high on her. Well, he's young. They're young. And you talked to him about that. You made me talk a little bit about that. But they're young. But he says, you know, sometimes they, they play uh, really exceptional, and then sometimes I guess they're, you know. But that's a young team. Consistency. It's, yeah, it's a consistency issue. And uh, it's okay. a young team, but he's a good coach, and he's uh, he's coached some really good players. Simpson again with a miss. Medway with the rebound. They push it up the floor. Holliston up back. Medway running a little weave, looks for the back door. There's the cut in the middle. Oh, and there's going to be a travel. And that's another thing that Holliston does. They play so well defensively with, with their feet. And by that, I mean they can slide and hit. They're not reaching with their hands. They're using their feet, walk with the body. And so many times, just getting in front of a player, it will cause a player to have a turnover like that, especially a traveling turnover. And, and they have their hands up all the time on defense. They do. Blocking those passing lanes. Simpson Whoa. with the step through. <laughs> doesn't grab any rim. Is that one of those Euro step things? That, that's <laughs> one of those Euro steps, you know. And matter of yeah. fact, the girls were practicing that over on the side here before the game. And, uh, you know, as a, as a former referee, I don't want, even want to talk yeah. about the Euro step. Don't get me going. There's a travel from Hollison. 5.50 left. Uh, 
from, I'm sorry, Medway travel. 5.49 left to go in the first quarter. So, so as we were talking before the game, I, I did a little comparison of common opponents. Okay, Holliston working the ball. And I found some very interesting things. Oh, nice pick and roll. Oh, and there's a travel. Yeah. That was Mia Quinzani, you know, you know, had nice pick and roll, but then couldn't find yep. any daylight down there. And you got to get that really quick. A and be, little bit of pressure here. The other, the other thing would be that would be good would be to get it a little bit higher to her instead of the bounce pass. Okay, long, wide open shot, no good. Oh, oh offensive nice rebound, rebound by number four, uh, sophomore Victoria Bullard with the putback. Megan Simpson. Count it. Oh, only a two-pointer from out there. Seven to four, five minutes left to go in the first quarter. Holliston again with more pressure. Okay, they're moving the ball. Katie Williams with great defense. Yeah, nice defense. Oh, I think Katie might have got her in the arm. Yeah. All right, it's going to be midway. Ball coming inbounds under their base, under their basket. Both teams with two fouls now. 7 4, Hollison down three. Oh, there's a nice. Oh, oh what a block, block by Carolyn Brady. That's and it. she's got the ball, gives it to Megan Simpson, and they push it up the floor. What a block by that Caroline. Was really nicely done. Megan. Simpson with the jump shot, Ooh, no good. Okay, Medway coming back. Oh, nice post position, number four for Medway, but oh, going to be Medway ball. Uh, number four for Medway, Victoria Bullard, get gets some nice deep post position. Yeah, that's a that's but, a uh, that's a Holliston name, by the way. What you doing over there? I know, historic Bullard. historic Hol uh, Holliston name. Nice cut off, nice cutting off that baseline. Oh. Shot is up, no good. Simpson pulls the ball down. Now she'll oh, push. Tricky she'll dribbles push. up. She'll keep going. Jump shot, no good. Medway outlet. See, that's no. where if if you can get a one of your forwards down there quickly to to beat uh, Megan, she could have just zipped a little pass and then you would have a nice little easy layup. Three point shot, no good. Offensive rebound. Uh, there's a foul on Holliston. I think if we run the tape back here, uh, I'm, I'm seeing offensive rebound by Medway an awful lot, yeah. you know? So I, I think that's one of our issues right at the moment. That is, and you know, and, and it's interesting that Coach mentioned uh, rebounding is a key because really that's something they've been very, very good at this year is rebounding. Okay, Medway inbounds to number 10, trying to find daylight. Working at the top. Brady on the ball. Oh, number two with the drive. Flips it up, no good. Brady tracks it down. They got a little size in there. Uh, Medway does. A little bit, yeah. You know, they're, they look, they're long and lanky, I think. Uh, there we go. Uh, Mia Quinzani with the shot. Now, no we good. haven't seen two of the time. We will pretty soon see two of the top teams uh, Right, we'll be seeing uh, Medfield and, and Westwood, but this right now is the, is the team with more height oh, than, than I've seen. Oh, good That's number four, Victoria Bullard. What a nice left, to, fake yep. to the left, and then go right, and uh, real nice job. Three minutes left to go in the first quarter. Sophomore. This is one of the things we talked a lot about uh, Hollison's got to do, too. It's free, sh free throw shooting has got to be uh, much better for Holliston. And this is the second. Nice box out by Mia. Yeah, Quinzani comes away with it. Simpson, spin move with the little Bang. hook shot. Man, that, that little hook shot. Yeah, that she's, she's got, got that down. That's not just something that she's coming down and throwing up, either. She's, that's something you can tell she practices. Long three-point attempt around the rim and out by Bullet, I believe. 
Okay, and that's going to be another offensive rebound by Medway. And a foul by Holliston. Uh, second foul on Kaylee McDonald, so she's got to sit. And Medway will inbound. Kaylee's a good rebounder, too. Kaylee averages about five rebounds a game. For, for a sophomore guard. Oh, Bob. Nice play. All right, number 24, uh, Lucy Bauman is in the game and immediately makes a difference. Makes a difference. Well, you know, we talked a little bit about Lucy as being somebody who's contributing offensively for, for Holliston. She had uh, a few really nice shots the other night. And, um, you know, that's what Coach is looking for, someone else to uh, help relieve the pressure on Megan offensively. Yep. Megan Lyons is also there in the game. There she is. LB with the shot. No good. And as we said earlier, and you had talked about this, uh, just attempting the shot makes a big deal for Holliston because you've got to let the other team know that uh, you're going to be trying to shoot too. They've got to come out and guard you. Long uh, three. Number two. Good. That's uh, Ellie Copeland with a three-pointer. Simpson right back with a two-point shot. Ooh. Oh, rattles around the rim. It's going to be Holliston ball. 158 to go here in the first quarter. 10-6. Inbounds to Quinzani. She spin moves into the middle. Goes up with it. Gets it blocked. Yep. But it's still going to be Holliston ball. And that's fine. Yep. You, you got to go keep in. challenging them. Get in you there. Know, make that move to the basket. There it is. There it is. Long shot. That's no a good. nice shot, though. Wide open. Holliston ball. Okay. So let's see. You notice, even though it was Holliston ball, all five of them were back here to play defense. That's that quick transition that, that Holliston does from offense to defense. Goes into the low post. Yeah. Is use Brady. Backboard. Use that backboard. Nice Brady with back. a nice post move. Carolyn Brady, she starts choosing the backboard, and Mia starts using the backboard. They're going to start making a lot of shots because they get a lot of rebounds in close. Going to be midway ball. Good defense by Holliston. Good crowd here tonight, Jay. Yeah. Well, it is midway. Yeah, yeah, okay. Oh, inbound right along the baseline. Shot is up. No That's good. Holliston. Move. That was a pretty move by the midway player. Quinzani with the ball yeah, up top, she's looking for the about cut it. Is, Oh, nice. Good pass into in LB. The, and the shot is no good, but she's fouled. And she'll be going to the line. It's a third foul on Medway. Hollison has five fouls. 10 to 8. Hollison down two. 114 left to go in the first quarter. And she makes the first. Okay. That's a big shot. That's a, that's a big shot. Get, get, that, get that first one. Second and shot. No good. Out. Okay, number 21, uh, St. John is in for Holliston. Oh, boy. Long three-pointer. No good. Uh-oh. They're going to talk about it. Yeah, I kind of thought that was on off of Megan. Yeah, it was. Okay. Good call. That's, that's a good job by the ref. you got to get in there. And got to figure out if one sees it better than the other. <laughs> yeah, that happens sometimes. You know, you, you, when you're on the baseline and it, it goes out in the far corner, you can't quite see it. Goes into the middle on the cut, Locked. number 33. The shot is blocked. I'm not sure if you, that was Caroline to get her hand in there. Okay. 54 seconds in the quarter. They move it. Oh, Simpson with a long three-pointer. Oh, oh, St. John with the rebound. Pitches it back out. Brady with the shot. No good. Medway with the rebound. Good She's double doubled team. up. Good double team. As long as you're there, you might as well double her. Okay. Holliston's in a zone right now. 28 seconds left. Number Long 10 threes. for That's Medway. Off. Off. Now, hold it for one unless there's someone that St. breaks. St. John with the rebound. If nobody breaks deep, you want to hold this for one shot. You'll, 
Set up your offense with about seven seconds left to go. That's when you want to go run your offense. And there we go. Nice shot by Lions. No good. Oh, Wait, offensive rebound. rebound by Caroline Brady. Put back is no good. Two seconds. Medway with a long three quarter shot, and it's no good. And the quarter ends with Medway leading 10 to 9. Nice back and forth by both of these ball clubs. And you said it earlier, Steve, that they're, they're two um, very uh, well balanced teams, two, two teams that are, are very close as, as far as talent wise and, uh, and youth wise, too. And I, I, I did some analysis and I looked at the common opponents between these teams. They played this. The same seven common opponents in both teams were three and four against them. And their three wins were all against the same teams. The four losses were against the same teams. So that's the balance we have right here. We're watching tonight, you know, yeah. with these two teams. A um, couple things I did notice in looking at those games. Uh, the Bellingham game. Uh, Medway scored 51 points, you know, in the Bellingham game, whereas Holliston, you know, they were both, both teams won, but Holliston only scored 40 points yep. as opposed to Medway's 51 points. But on the positive side, um, you know, Holliston's defense has been good. Yep. And uh, we typically have been holding teams to less points than Medway has, yeah. you know, so. And that's what you see. I mean, they just, uh, you know, we, we just rave about this defense. It's really, really good. Um, and they, a lot of the teams that they, I mean, that, that Westboro win, you know, beating a team that uh, is playing very well. And that, that was all defense. And, you know, and then every so often you'll get, like, the, the Megan shot against, uh, who was that against? Is that Dedham? Uh, uh, Dedham, yes. Dedham. The, the three-pointer at the end of the, at the end of regulation to tie it and then, Hollison came back and I think beat him two to one in overtime to win the game. But it's that defense has, has been really good for Holliston. And part of it oh, is a travel. travel. See, yep. that's that's exactly what's trying to play with your feet. She um, Megan got over there really quickly. She can react quickly. She has good recovery speed, very quick. She got in position quickly, and the the shooter wasn't ready for her to be there that quickly, and that's what caused the uh, the walk. Okay, nice pick by Quinzani. An open three-point shot. No good. Medway comes up with the rebound, and they're running. Holliston does a great job of getting back. Oh, Mia. Me, uh, ooh, nice D. She almost stole yeah. it. Okay, she's trying to... Whoa. Oh, boy, there's number two. Uh, Ellie three. Copeland. She's had two threes now, right? That's right. 13-9, Holliston down four. 7-13 left to go in the first half. Okay, Simpson comes out of the corner with a jump shot. No nice good. Rebound. Oh, Count offensive it. rebound. Was that Ava St. John with the rebound? It might have been. But that was played perfectly. Didn't bring the ball down. Kept the ball up high. Went off the glass and scored. All right, Hollison's in a zone now. Uh, around the, the rim and out. Oh. That was halfway down. Yeah, Mia with the rebound. All right. Oh, ball's tipped away from Megan. Goes over to. Oh. Get in there. Oh. <laughs> Put back, no good. Ah, Hollison, no luck there. Uh, Megan Lyons, we thought that was going down. Cast a bullet. Yes. That's no Offensive good. rebound by Medway. And Pull it again. No, no good. good. And Megan sends him with the ball. Okay. Oh, she just drives right to the hoop. A little runner. No good. Quinzani picks that rebound there up. There it is. Nice call. Megan Lyons. I like seeing the kids calling for the ball tonight. I've seen more calling for the ball than I've seen in any of the games we've done. And that's a great indication the kids want the ball so they can shoot. Yep, yep. And they really, really need that. They really need to spread that defense and not let them uh, just focus 100% on Megan uh, Simpson. Yeah, and that was a nice play. Um, it went to Ava St. John, and then Quinzani was calling for the ball, and she got fouled. There we go. Gets her shot blocked, but uh, Hollison comes away with it. Oh, stolen by Medway. Nice steal by Medway. 
That was Reagan. Uh, Re Regan. Long belt. Oh, long three point. Oh my oh, goodness! Great rebound. Number put fifteen, back. Anna Freshman, Anna Freeman with a putback uh, left wide she's, open on she's the board. She's a freshman. There. She's she's going to make a lot of noise in this league. She has a lot of size to her. Yeah, definitely. Okay. Um, Time out, Holliston. All right. Yep. Okay. Time out, Holliston, with 5.23 to go in the second period. Uh, Medway leading 15 to 11. Um, so, I, I, you know, once again, you know, Holliston's counted on their defense and their rebounding, and, and um, so far we haven't been great at, Yep. Our defense and our our defense has been okay. Our rebounding, we're giving up too many second chances. That's right. The re, the the defense has been good. There's been just one or two little lapses. But you know what? You can't be perfect. I mean, right? So, but um, yes, the rebounding um, got to do a little bit better. But the good news is that's something they can really do better. So that's just something that okay, we'll focus on that a little bit more and get it done. Um, still looking for for some other scoring. But like I said earlier. One of the things I haven't seen that the girls are kind of doing tonight, some of them are putting their hands up saying, you know, pass the ball to me, you know, I'll take the shot. And um, like, like Coach said, we talked about this the last game, and Coach put this down today as one of the uh, keys to the game. It's not just shoot, but shoot with confidence. So we were talking about um, how young this Medway team is. Uh, the, uh, the varsity has uh, four seniors, two juniors, Five sophomores and two freshmen on the roster, and then they have uh, on the they have two JV teams, and there are uh, four and there's like 17 sophomores and freshmen <laughs> on on the other teams, you know, 19 on the JV teams, you know. So they are really young. I don't know. Yeah, I've never seen. A school have so many young kids. Oh, inbound pass Great along block. the baseline. Is it stripped, I think. Jump ball. It's going to be Holliston. That was Quinzani down Is there. That, uh, I'm not sure who who slapped that ball away. It might have been Mia. Okay, there's a nice give and go. Kaylee McDonald coming up the court, dishes it off to Brady. There oh, it is. nice there pass to uh, Quinzani. MQ yep. tracks down her own rebound. And there's a shot from the outside. Oh, no good by LB. That's okay, though. They're getting some shots. They're getting some wide-open shots here. Yep, yep. They got to just keep moving the ball. 445 left to go in the half. Oh, nice move. Long three-pointer again. Kaylee McDonald with the rebound. Yeah, Man, we talked about that. She, she is a good rebounder. She really is. For her size and... It, it's her quickness. That, yep. uh, oh, nice pass to uh, Megan Simpson cutting the baseline. Yeah, Megan oh. kind of reached. I think, I think she frustration was... Getting, yeah, frustration foul. Frustration. Getting a little frustrated at the, the shots. I think, I think Megan right now may be trying to do it just a little bit too much. And what, once, what, what will happen is she will adjust. And she'll slow it down. We've seen we've seen this before a little. Sometimes when the the double and triple teaming her, and I'm not saying she gets frustrated all the time, but then all of a sudden she'll make a shot and she'll get red hot, and then she just she just goes and takes off. And that's how you get to be a, a 21 point scorer in this league. Okay, Megan Lyons comes in for Lucy Bauman, and the shot is missed by freshman Anna Freeman. Yeah, it seems like she's left-handed, too. You like those left-handers, I like huh? it every sport. <laughs> every sport. It's, it's different. Okay, into Brady. There's the cut. Brady moves it to Quinzani. Out to Kaylee. Over they got to come set up. They got to come set up. Pick. There's a nice... Oh, she went the other way. And there's the runner. No good. Brady battling for that rebound. Gonna look down, but don't let that ball go inside. Oh, nice pass inside! That's but nice help. That's Caroline Brady help. steps into the passing lane. Yeah, what happened is Mia, Mia took the the player, and when the ball came in, uh, Caroline was there ready to step in and make a steal. Good team defense, and that's what they need to step up a little bit. Simpson on the drive, no good. She tips her own rebound, gets it back. 
Baseline jumper, won't fall. Oh, crashing the boards is Lions. Quinzani with the rebound and put and again, back. Again, again, Oh, they are the just, all, white shirts all over the boards. They're there. pounding the boards. All right, Midway trying to set. They get it into the low post. Oh, there's oh, a nice a cut through the middle. Pass. And Ellie Copeland with the layup and will go to the free throw line. Olivia Canary with a great pass. I love that give and go. We talked about that a little earlier, right? You know, we talked about the team that I coach in summer league with the boys, and we had three plays, give and go, pick and roll, and pass break, and that's all we needed. You know, you, you, can, you, you learn how to give and go, and you learn how to pick and roll. That's every offense. And, uh, and that was uh, Olivia Canary. Oh, Canary, I'm sorry. Shot is no good. Brady with the rebound. Sorry, Olivia. Whatever it is, you did a beautiful pass. I ought to know. I had a Canary in my uh, Marion class. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wonder if they're related. Probably a great granddaughter. <laughs> Lions with the shot, no good. Oh, offensive rebound. Oh, what a nice by LB. There it is. Brady yeah, over to Quinzani. You know, you know, they've worked that enough. Brady knows when she gets the ball in the post that the help comes, and Quinzani is on the other post, and she's open. There you go. There we go. 17-12. She was working on her free throws before the game. That's what you got to do. We talk about this so often, how many of these games have come down to that. Speaking of which, uh, Holliton has eight fouls, so Medway will be shooting the bonus in the next foul. All right, Medway pushing it up, drive along the baseline by Keep number her in four. There. Great deal, great deal. Loses it to, uh, who was that? That was LB and uh, with the, the steal. All right, Kaylee McDonald running the point. Oh, nice quick move, Megan Lyons. Yeah, there you go. That's a sixth foul, so that will not be a shooting foul quite yet. Oh, they're going to give her the... Oh, they say she was in the act. All yeah. right. Oh, man, we're not having any luck. Megan is a junior. Uh, Megan Simpson just returns to the ball game. Oh. oh, good hustle. Good hustle by Kellen. Megan Lyons is shooting it. She very fast with the ball. And, you know, you, you want to get a good transition from defense to offense. She's one of the ones who can do that for Holliston. All right, Medway trying to break Holliston's man-to-man. -man. It's a drive to the middle. Nice, nice. And the yeah, pass nice goes idea. out of bounds. That is not the, the fault of, um, was that Copeland who, was, who threw that pass? That was not her fault. That They were, threw it right in between two players, two Medway players. Either one of them could have picked it up and uh, maybe even scored. Hollison down 5, 17, 12, 156 to go. All right, Simpson with the ball. The Lions. Oh, oh nice, nice, nice drive down the middle. Hits the back of the rim. I, I really, really, really hope they don't get frustrated with the results of these shots because these are the shots they need to start taking. They will fall. They will go. There's a nice steal. Oh, there we go. LB with the steal. And the ball is tipped out of bounds by Medway. But you know what I'm saying, Steve? I mean, they, they've, been, they've been doing well. They've been just, just missing, just missing. Don't get frustrated. Keep doing that. You're doing really, really well. Once those start falling, you'll see three or four of them fall in a row. And then you get the lead in the game. Brady inbounds to LB. Shot is no good, and it is tracked down by Midway. But again, another good play. They ran, they ran the play for someone other than Megan. It's a long three by Copeland. Oh, she's oh good. my goodness. Not nope. Copeland, I'm sorry. That's, that uh, a... Regan Longbow. Longbow. And, and it's interesting. Uh, Medway really likes the threes. They're not afraid to shoot yep. them. Simpson with a drive, no good. Almost stolen. All right, there's a double. Oh, 
All right, Medway pushing it now. Into the middle, it's to play. Oh, there we travel. go, travel. That hole in the middle was closing up and <laughs> she's trying to go quick. 52 seconds left to go in the second quarter. Medway leading 20 to 12. Okay, Midway in a oh, zone. She's thinking uh, about it. Box and one. Excuse me. Oh, there's a nice, nice pass to Brady oh, down oh, low. <laughs> Quinzani to Brady. That's a, quite the combination. And, and Carolyn Brady is using that backwood tonight a couple times. I haven't really seen her do that a lot in the past. And that's going to get her a lot of points in this league. And they were practicing those before the game, too. Quinzani and Brady uh, buddy up and before the game and uh yeah, oh boy. You, you know what happened you, she just put her hands on her okay so the foul was on uh lucy Bauman. lucy just coming around and you know that's an example of instead of using your feet she kind of put her hands on the on the player good, good call by the ref on that one 16.3 seconds left okay and uh regan makes the first one She's a freshman. And can't. Ooh. Oh, wow. That's okay, it's going to be Holliston Ball. This is, this is, see, this coaching is really good. This is what you want to do. You don't have a lot of time left. You want to force some time off the clock. Look at Callum Brady. Oh, yeah. Court. Yeah, she's a good ball handler for, uh, for a big person. Oh, nice try to the middle, one. yes! <laughs> Ava St. John with the basket and goes to the free throw line. I have not seen these girls use the backboard as much as I have tonight, and it's, it's fantastic. Okay, 6.8 seconds left. And uh, Bauman comes out. St. John at the free throw line. Big arc, doesn't get it. Medway with the rebound. Oh, watch her, number 10. Oh, oh. that was uh, Shannon Mejia, and uh, she hit the front of the rim on that shot. That, that was as close as you can get it. Yeah, I saw, I saw visions of Dedham. Yeah, there you go, and she had a good look at that. 21-16 at the end of the half. Uh, Medway leading Holliston, and um, we a very good half, uh, I think. Uh, I think there's a room for improvement, and I think we can do it. So yeah, yeah it's it's going to be um, defense. Keep up that defense. I mean, you've only given up 21 points. You get you got it up to 16. You're going to have to probably do a little bit better than that. But uh, right now, keep keep doing what you're doing, and uh, you have a shot at the you know at this ball game at the end. All right, we'll be back in a few minutes.
Okay, we're back uh, after the halftime break, and I feel very refreshed now. And uh, oh, yeah. okay. <laughs> uh, Medway leading 21 to 16, and uh, I've got some statistician Steve has some stats. Yeah. So if you're ready for them, Jay. I'm ready, buddy. Okay, we got uh, for Medway, uh, Regan Longval has four points. Ellie Copeland has eight points, including two three-pointers. Uh, Victoria Bullard has two points. Anna Friedman has two points. And Olivia Melanson has five points. On the Holliston side, we've got uh, Mia Quinzani with one point. Caroline Brady with four points. Lucy Bauman with one point. Ava St. John with four points. And Megan Simpson with six points. So 21-16 Medway lead. Well, it's good defense. We've seen um, good defense again by Hollison, keeping this team to 21 points. And now you just got to find a little bit more offense. This 16 points is is a little bit a little bit below where they should be. You know, they, they should probably be right now around 25 points, something like that. That's what they want to. That's what they want to look at. 20, well, 24, 25 points. But you know, a lot of that is um, free throws. You know, you make your free throws and keep keep making those uh, those layups underneath. That that's really a really big improvement. I, I'm not sure if there's something they've worked on, but I can see a big difference there. And also, um, it's great, like when Coach said, have people shoot with confidence. That That's what you see when you see people asking for the ball and when they, you know, put your hand up and ask for the ball. So a lot of that, and, and that, um, that uh, Brady-Quinzani combo underneath has <laughs> really worked pretty well offensively. Yeah, I think we need to get the ball back into them more, yep. and I think they'll start putting more of those shots down. Um, I think the biggest thing that hit me in the first half is we got to seal off the boards and not give Medway those second shots. Right. Not giving up those offensive rebounds yep. because, you know, if I mean, if they got two or three baskets on offensive rebounds, which I'm not sure, sure whether they did or didn't, you know, but say they got two. Yep. Okay, that's, that's four points. That's and, the difference. And this is a ball game right yep. here, you know? Well, the other thing is, too, I think, I think you're going to see um, Megan um, Simpson – uh, maybe turn it on a little bit now in the in the third quarter. And then again, she'll, you know, uh, boy, she's such a great player. And, and she will uh, make one or two shots, and then she's off and running. And then it's like you can't stop her. All right, Medway gets the ball first to start the second half. Holliston comes out in the man-to-man. -man. Nice help defense. And wow, I didn't see who tipped that away. It might have been Katie Williams. And then... Um, I think Quinzani was the one. Who yeah, she was on the floor. Mia was on the one on the floor. She was the one that got fouled. Okay. All right. Medway putting on a little bit of pressure. We got number two uh, Copeland on on uh, Megan Simpson. Nice pick by Williams to free up Megan to get the ball. There's a double again. Simpson to the baseline. Medway with the rebound. Oh, God, nice, nice spin Wow. Move. That's number 10, uh, Shannon Mejia with her first basket. Yeah, she's a captain for uh, Medway, another good player. Senior. All right, Williams with the ball, looking at Kaylee McDonald. I think we need a little bit more spacing. We're, yeah. we're all clumping up here. Okay, long three-pointer, open three-pointer for... Simpson. Medway with the rebound and pushes it up the floor. Holliston is back in there man to man. Baseline oh. jumper. Oh, see now that's a tough matchup for Megan Simpson as uh, Bullard is a little bit taller. Yep. And she can handle and the ball well and she she's a good shooter down around the basket it looks like also. She's got a legitimate jump shot and get up over Simpson. Simpson with the there two point is. shot. Is good. Yeah. Like I said, it's going to take her one or two shots, and when she gets going, it's like that well-oiled machine. You know, you oil that machine, and it starts working a little bit better. Okay. Midway working the ball. Nice back cut. 
Oh, here's another cut through Good the middle. Deed. Good D. Uh, foul on Kaylee. I think that might oh. be his third. Well, they'll tell us pretty quickly. Yep, that is, is his third. Her third. Okay, she's a little frustrated with that. Well, what happened so, is she was she was trailing, and uh, trailing the, the the player she was covering and got caught. The other player stopped and she went down. Long shot by number two for Medway, no good. Uh, Copeland. Good transition by Harlison. Simpson pushing it. Bang. Three point shot by who was that? I think it was, that was Lucy, I think, uh, wasn't it? Lucy Bauman. Yep, again. She has the range now. That was a semi block. Shot by it Medway. Like. Jump ball. Hollison ball. 5.28 left to go in the third. This would be nice here if Hollison can come down and score a basket and get it to within two. Yeah, I think once they can, you know, get to get it tied, I think then we can really, you know, feel a little life. There's Lucy. There's Lucy. There she is. Two-point shot. Ooh, oh, almost. no good. Ball tipped out. Simpson comes away with it. Set a pick for her. Nice, nice job. Looks for the pick and roll. Out to Williams. Oh, oh in Brady. Into Brady. Brady with the baseline layup, and uh, Medway blocks it. That was a really nice block, too. That was a nice block. They nice. set up the box. And, oh, gee. Mia Quinzani was open on a very nice cut into the low post, and the ball just went off her foot on the pass. Hollison only down four, though. Five minutes left to go in the third. Ooh. Did she pick that ball up? <laughs> that was just a hesitation. Okay. Okay. Ooh, oh. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Oh, bombing. Okay, Holliston. Oh. Yeah. Now that's, all right, we lose the ball, and now we foul and uh, send Medway to the line shooting two. This is... Oh, by Mia. Mia had great position there. It's just when, when you go to block and you bring your hand down at all, it's going to get called a foul. Okay, makes the first one. Victoria Bullard. Only a sophomore. And it makes the second one. Boy, she's going to be playing it. They're going to have a really, really strong team next year. Oh, yeah. They got a couple good years ahead of them. Simpson with a long two-pointer off the backboard and in. See, this is what happens. She starts to heat up. Okay. Holliston. Good defense. Rebound Bauman. Pitches it to Brady. <laughs> Cal, <laughs> Cal, I don't want that thing. Oh, come on, Carol. Give it to a guy. Put it on the floor. Oh, nice rebound. Oh, Quinzani pulls that out of the air. Over to Quinzani again. She puts it Cut up it. and in. Yes. Quinzani and with the hoop. Time out Medway. 3.59 left in the third period, and it's Medway 27, Holliston 25. So the Lady Panthers are coming back. Well, I'll tell you, we talked about the defense. We talked about the rebounding. But tonight, those rebounds are starting to go right back up and in. And that's what you need to do with, on those offensive boards. It's great to get offensive rebounds, but it's even better when you get it. Don't bring it down. Just keep it right up and put it right in. Nicely played by and Holliston. And the thing I noticed too is there, you know, the girls are hitting the square, the white square Absolutely. up there. Absolutely, that's what that's when what you, it's there for. When you get the ball in that square, yep. it's going to go in. And I saw them practicing that before the game, so they're really working on this stuff. Yep. So okay, so now uh, three fifty nine left to go here. Just just under four minutes left to go in the third quarter. And you see what's happening is I talked about this a little bit in the first half of it. I hope they weren't getting too frustrated because they are making good shots and just not going in. 
now you see some of them start to go in. Even that one that um, uh, Megan Simpson kind of went off to the left, off to the right, and put it up off the backboard and in. That's what's going to happen. These things are going to start falling. You've got to just have faith in yourself. That's that confidence that the coach is talking about. Get your confidence in your shooting, and they're getting that now, and it's great to see. Okay, so after the Medway timeout and the Holliston run, Medway inbounds, and they'll go the length of the floor. No pressure by Holliston. Holliston's in a zone. They're in a zone right now. Oh, oh nice try by Megan. Nice try. <laughs> I think now, they, if she had gotten that, would they? Have, they would not have called that a, a kick. She didn't actually. The ball was thrown her. at her leg, okay. you know, okay. and uh, so, so she didn't. Difference. She didn't try to kick it, right? And that's why also the shot clock is not reset. Oh, another foul. It's on okay. Lucy, I think. That might be a second. Yep. A third. third. That's a third. Third foul on Lucy. And Medway will inbound underneath. It's great to see them, the, the coaching staff, getting a... Uh... Oh, is that your <laughs> oh, jump ball? Oh, nah, she had her on the arm, unfortunately. Wow. That's two quick fouls. That the yeah. fourth foul on Holliston. The one thing you don't want to get is get it so that they get a, a lot of free throws. Because they were a pretty good free throw shooting team. There's a long three. Count it. Oh, who's that? Number 21 for Medway, Olivia Melanson. Shot by LB, no good. Medway comes away with it again. All right, don't foul out there. Uh, Simpson goes for the steal. Medway. Stole. Oh, and there's the steal on the help defense. Simpson looking up. The Euro step into the middle. Holliston with the rebound. Williams with the Bang. putback. There it is. Two-point shot for Williams. One possession game again. 30-27. 2.48 left to go in the third quarter. Again, Megan. Okay, everybody's got to get back. They cover. Boy, they, they are quick reacting, Holliston is, defensively. But this, this um, Medway offense is really pretty good. Oh, Simpson beats her to the ball. Nice hustle. She's and coming. she lays it in. She's coming, I tell you. It just takes a few, and then she starts getting hot. 12 points for Megan Simpson. One point game. Okay, they go down low to the big girl. Oh, oh. no, no. Oh, oh okay. okay. I was going to say, don't call us all on that. That's a travel on Medway, and it's going to be Hollis and Ball. We get subs in. Uh, Quinzani comes out. LB comes out. And uh, Megan Lyons comes in. And Ava St. John comes Anna, in. Anna Freeman comes out for Medway. Boy, she is going to be a force. She looks like she's a pretty good player. It looks like she's pretty knowledgeable, too, in what to do. Okay, it is Katie Williams. Gets stuck it down low, gets it out to Simpson. Over to Lyons, looking cross court. Williams with the baseline drive, jump shot, no good. Uh, Look at the fight. Look the, at the fight in there. Oh. Brady can't come away with it. Medway had, picks up the loose ball. I think Kelly gets smacked in the mouth there too. Oh, drive down the middle is that good pretty? by number wow. 21, uh, Melanson. Olivia Melanson. She's put up a couple big baskets. She's now got. For, she's got 10 in the game. Okay, Hollison works the ball over to Brady, back out. Simpson with the three-point shot. Great rebound, count it! <laughs> Is that Caroline Brady? Yep. Okay. 102 left to go in the third. I like I liked when Hollison went back. Looks like they, look, they went... Ooh. All right, baseline drive by Medway. No good, and Brady is going to rip that ball away from two Medway girls. Simpson pushes Hollison, it. Hollison got out of that zone and went back to man-to-man, -to -man, and that's where they're very comfortable. Okay, Simpson was feeling it. Two-point shot, no good. All right, Medway coming back. Fast-paced game here. Oh, nice defense. 
tipped by Katie Williams. It goes out of bounds. 26 seconds left to go in this quarter. The shot clock's at 25. Okay, this is number 20, this is uh, Josie move. Quinn coming in. This Caroline Brady this coming out. Move. Yeah, this gives Carolyn a long, long rest period here. Okay, Medway inbounds. Okay, shot from the corner. Oh, wow. wow. That was out in the far corner. That's number 10. No fear. Mejia, <laughs> the captain. You gotta give these Medway girls credit. They have absolutely no fear. There's the double on Megan. Takes it around the other side. The runner, no good. Simpson looking for the rebound. And that's going to be the end of the third quarter as Medway has a 35 to 31 lead over Holliston. Well, we cut into it a little bit. And we got it down to one. And uh, Holliston got some, some nice shooting there. That was, a, that was a good quarter for them. 15 points in a quarter. They, they had 16 going in, right? So 15 yes. points this quarter. That's really good. You, you score anywhere between 12 and 15 points with this defense and rebounding, and you're going to win a lot of games. Uh, you know, and we held Medway to 21 points in the half. You know, that's, you know, 42 in the game. And that's doing – that's a yeah. good defensive job. Yeah. You know, so uh, – They scored quite a few points this half. But they, boy, they were really good. I'm telling you, they're going to be – they're going to be special next year. They are really going to be something. And – and I know the coach said about the consistency he had talked to you about, but um, you look at this team and look how they're built with the with the speed, the shooting, the the size they're going to have. They're they're going to be in great shape next year. So we get and just looking ahead on the schedule, uh, we get some special nights coming up, and you can confirm this mm -hmm. uh, that I got it right. Uh, Friday, February tenth. Against Norwood is going to be senior night. Senior night, yep. And now, listen, we, we love when you people watch us on TV, but get down here that night and, you know, give the girls a, uh, a little congratulations for the great uh, uh, career they've had. Very special night. And then on uh, Tuesday, February 14th, against Ashland, uh, is going to be pink night. So get out your pink that's, shirts. Yep, and, that's uh, for, the, for, for um, cancer. cancer prevention. And uh, that'll be, again, that'll be Ashland, and that'll be a good game, too. That's one that the girls might might be in a position if they win that game. Who knows what happens? So get down here and support the girls. But if you can't, thank you for tuning in to us. Yeah, we welcome all of our um, Holliston viewers, and we welcome the Medway viewers. Absolutely. We hope there's a lot watching. Absolutely. Bruce, how many we got watching tonight? Maybe Thomas will know that, probably. Oh, maybe Tom knows that. All right. Huh? Oh, there's a travel. 7.44 left to go in regulation here. And now what you got to do, Steve, when you get down here, two things. you got to take advantage of the turnovers. And when you go to the free throw line, you got to make your free throws. Here's a, here's a box and one that they like to throw at the oh. Megan. But she knows. Oh, boy. <laughs> All right, they're doubling again. Oh, they're going to double. So we get to move without the ball, the other four players. And there's a steal. Medway pushing it up the floor. Oh, man. Whoa. All right, back outside, the up fake and drive to the middle. The shot is up, no good. Medway offensive rebound, Ooh. and there's... That's a great play by uh, Olivia Canary, senior captain. Well, Avery St. John, I, was that the following? Who? No, the Cullen. And I think it was on uh, Mia. Yeah, MQ. And that's her fourth. And Olivia makes the first shot. Wait, Mia and Caroline are, are so big on that defensive end too that they help so much underneath they get underneath them they're great anchors for the defense and the second shot is good senior makes two scores back up to six midway up by six seven minutes left regulation 
Okay, there's a, there we go. Move to the open space. Simpson open, no good. Hollison tips it, nice play. Uh, Caroline keeps the dribble, gets it to Katie Williams. Simpson on the drive. Oh, man. Should be shooting two. This is where it comes down to. It's going to come down to free throw shots. 6.38 left and, to go in the thir uh, regulation. And I think Megan Lyons was the one who tipped that rebound out, the original rebound, to keep the play down at our end. Makes the first. That's four fouls on uh, Victoria Bullard, sophomore. No good on the second shot. Okay. Drive from the corner, Brady trying oh. to cut it off. Offensive rebound wow. by number 15, Anna Freeman, yeah, freshman. That's the freshman. That's what I'm saying. She really knows how to play that really well. Simpson with the foul line jump shot, rolls out. Oh, offensive Count rebound it. by Lyons is good. Lyons with the putback. Her first points of the night. Leads down to five. Six minutes left in regulation. Oh, travel, oh. travel, travel. Yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> nice call. Well, now but we, take but we, but that, we lost the steal on that. We had the steal. <laughs> well, Steve, the statistician, I was going to stuff those stats. <laughs> 55. Okay, Simpson over to Brady. Williams. Williams. Having trouble, balls on the floor. Holliston it's going to be Holliston ball in the scramble. Plenty of time with 19 seconds on the shot clock. 39 okay. 34. Holliston looking to get this down to a one possession game. There's a spin into the middle. She's going to shoot two. There we go. All right. Five-point Medway lead, see if we can cut into it. There she goes, nicely to the plate. Cuts it to four. No good. Oh, almost stole him. No. <laughs> Brady almost stole that. Ava, a good battle on that rebound. Goes down, nice, cuts nice off the baseline by, by Lyons. Jump shot, no good, and it's going to be Hollison ball. Brady had that Steve, rebound, and Medway took it away. I want to tell you something about this box and one. Ordinarily, you'd say get get the ball, you know, quickly in and out of um, Megan Simpson's hands. I don't think you should. I don't think they can cover her. If once she gets by into that middle, they can cover. They're going to keep following her if she can get inside. That's the only way that they, they were able to uh, defend her. Now she's got to get it inside. If she can go down in seat now, down in there, down in there. There we go. Take it. Oh, nice drive to the hoop by Caroline Brady. That's a great drive and hoop. You know. See, that's what Caroline's good at, is getting the ball at the foul line and just going down the middle. Oh, they're going to call it. Yeah. Yeah. That was a good call. Yeah. It knocked her off balance. The ball goes out of bounds. And that's the seventh foul. So now they... That's only the second on uh, Megan. Are they call it? Oh, they, it's only six fouls. Okay. 21 with the long shot. Great. <laughs> Knocks out. Nothing but net. I wasn't sure whether it actually went in or not, yeah, but it did hit the net, but it didn't go through the rim. Okay, now, again, I'd spread everything. I would let her drive in because once she gets past this this first line of defense, the only thing they could do is foul her. Is the hook shot no good? Oh, nice rebound. Offensive rebound oh, don't by Don't get it out. Don't get Brady. it out. Get it in. 
and one. Oh, there we go. That's what I'm telling you. If she can work it down inside, the only thing they can do is foul her. They cannot keep up with her down, down um, defensively down below. Tie ball game here. 16 points for Megan Simpson. Has, has Hollison ever had the lead in this game? Uh, not that I know no, of. I don't think so. Well, they do now. 4-18 left in regulation. Bullet checks back in for Medway. And it's going to be a timeout. Holliston. Okay, so 4-18. Did you just say that? Yeah. 40-39. <laughs> Holliston. Wait a minute. <laughs> we work so well together, don't yeah. we? <laughs> like Mac and Meyer. Yeah. The, uh, I love this. We, so we got to step up our game because <laughs> those young kids doing the boys' games, they're, they're doing catch great. Us. They're going to yeah. catch us and, and pass us pretty quickly. I like getting, I, I want to say this again, I really like with Megan getting down inside there because it, um, either she's going to draw all the attention away from the other players down underneath or they're going to get her in the only way they can stop her because what she does is she always comes in quickly and shoots quickly. The only way they're going to stop her is to foul her, and that's what's happening here. Yeah, and, and I think I think our, our, our big girls got to know that. Yep. And when, when the defense collapses on Megan on the drive, the big girls got to go for the rebound, you yep. know, and we should be yep. clearing the boards and putting the offensive rebound right or, back up. Or we'll get down on the block, on the block, and get the ball that, so that Megan can get them the ball or that they can attack and then just put it up and in like they've done all night. But this is a great job defensively by uh, by Holliston in this quarter. They've, they've done a really nice job. It's all, Medway's only scored four points in this quarter. Is that right? Uh, yes. Yes. So you you, keep are you cheating key. off my notes? No. I can't read that. Are you kidding me? Not, not that your printing is bad. I can't read it, period. Oh, okay. I've got one good eye as it is. Put your glasses on. <laughs> All right. Medway with the ball. Back in the man. Hollis is back in their man-to-man. -man. And again, oh, they feel... There's a nice pick up top. They feel more comfortable, I think, in this man-to-man. -man. Not there. Oh, Hollis with the Good rebound. rebound by Brady. Brady is awesome. Boy, on the she's boards. so good, and not just not just that, but again, she's down below, anchoring that uh, that defense for Holliston. All right, Simpson with the ball. She kicks it up the top. All right, they're trying to move it. Simpson with the screen through. Rotate down rotate, to Lions on the baseline. The ball. Someone come and help her. There you go. All right, there you go. Oh, right oh. down the middle. There Dishes it, it off. There's a shot. No good. That's okay. Clean shot there Red by Saint Eva. John. That's a nice shot. Okay, Medway with... Ooh! Whoa. <laughs> to cut down the middle. Up. Oh, cool. Yeah. Yeah, that was a foul. There was a lot of body on that, yeah, you know, contact. We'd certainly want to have that called if oh, it was no, us, I, yeah. No, that's a, that's a good call. Yeah, There's nothing yeah. Right. 3.15 left to go in regulation. And uh, Victoria Bullard, number four. When she, when she went out with her fourth foul, I said, ooh, here goes a big score for them because she's, uh, again, only a sophomore. It, and she's got a legitimate jump shot. Oh, yeah. Look at, look at how smooth. Yeah. It, really, really nice job at free throw shooting. Eight points for her. Megan Lyons, baseline, no good. Hollison with the rebound. St. John into the post to Brady. Pitches it out. Williams. <laughs> Katie thought about that for a minute. Oh, down low. Nice move. Count it. Nice move by Callum Ava. Callum Brady. Callum Brady on a great pass. Okay, we get a discussion between the Medway coach yeah. and the... You got a warning. Okay. I want to. I got to tell you though. We know. We know Joe just a little bit. I mean, uh, we have a common friend, and uh, he is not only a really good coach. He's a really good guy. He really is. You know, he's. He's really done a lot for this Medway program. Okay, Medway with the ball again. Two forty-nine left to go. In regulation. Got to be careful okay. with Bullard. You can't Bullard, let Bullard yeah. free down there. Oh, no, 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 no. Back, yeah. You can't deny from behind. And now we're getting to the one-on-one -on -one situation. <laughs> a 
Okay, Kaylee McDonald comes back into the game for Katie Williams. Uh, also, Mia Quinzani came into the game. So High ball game right now, 237 left to go in regulation. Shannon Mejia with the free throw. Two free throws for the captain. Timeout Medway. Okay. Um, 237. We have uh, Mia, Mia with four fouls. I think Kaylee only has three. Does she have four? I don't keep track of the fouls, but uh, you the yellow, stat, stat guy. yell over to her dad. <laughs> her dad's doing the book. Oh, he is doing the book. <laughs> He's not getting there. 237 to go in the game, and uh, Coach has his starters back in the now starting lineup. And, you know, this is good for the girls. You, you get you get a shot to um, come in here and only only down a point, going back and forth. And now you see, again, once again, I, I know I keep saying it every game, it's probably going to come down to the same thing again, free throw shooting. But... Uh, Holliston now has eight eight fouls, and um, Medway only has four. So that could be a little issue unless Medway gets a couple quick fouls here, because um, they are they are really good free throw shooters. Yeah, yeah. Holliston, is, you know, a lot of their games have been close this year. You yeah. know, so they're used to playing in close yeah. games. They're they're in, in clutching the and you know. And this their defense. You know, if if you're playing in close games and it's an offense, well, maybe it comes, maybe it goes, maybe you miss, maybe you don't. But when you, when you have a defensively, when you're able to play in these close games, that's a big, big plus for Holliston. Big plus. Got a rebound. Here's a full court press. Yeah, Holliston's got to deal with this. Okay. Oh, no, nice move, Megan Lyons. Up fake and just. Yeah. Well, I talked about right Megan. I talked about Megan before being able to uh, go into transition really, really quickly. Now you got your, your point guard out there, Kaylee. Okay, baseline oh, drive nice by, Simpson. by Simpson. Oh, and she gets hit on the baseline. And She'll go shooting? to the line. Okay. I hope so. This is what you want. You want to be able to score with no time coming off the clock. 2.19 left to go in regulation. Megan's got 17 right at the moment. Nicely done. She's making a lot of the front ends of these. Tie game. 219 left to go, Meg. Ah. Rolls it in. Yeah, that's a shooter's roll. Nicely done. Okay, fun time coming up. Wallace playing that defense. Still in the man to man. All right. Oh. Bullet look, but she had no opening. Yeah, yeah, Holliston all over her. It's funny that they got Carolyn Brady on her. Well, they, I think they're just switching well, whenever they have to. Oh, Megan Lyon. Oh! Lyons with good defense uh -huh. on the drive. Uh, yeah. If we're going to do the rule that you just made that uh, we We'd be happy if that was us. <laughs> then I've got to give it to him. <laughs> That's your new rule. All right. This is 21, Olivia Melanson, a sophomore. Boy, they shoot free throws they very do. nice. They do. They really do. And you know what? I'm going to tell you right now. I, I don't know this, but I would be shocked if it wasn't something that they practice and practice and practice. Get the rebound here. Oh, Brady right with across the her face. All right, Simpson oh, pushes right down the middle. Oh, get out of jump there. Ball. Oh, she gets a jump ball. Holliston ball. Simpson reached in to tie up that ball on the Medway player. She and Bullard did. Two sophomores. They'll be going at it for a few years. Get a lot of sophomores. Kaylee McDonald. Nice, nice there. job by Mia. That's, ooh. Oh, man, that was halfway down. Look at Kaylee. Great D. Great D. Stolen from behind. Oh. Ooh, mid yeah. ball. Okay, Simpson made a great play to steal the ball, but uh, goes out of bounds. 
What, what hustle? What if, hustle? Offensively, the other team cannot beat uh, Kelly McDonald with her great speed. They, she transitions sensationally. Well, McDonald is covering Mejia. Okay. There's the drive to the middle by two. Rebound by Brady. Okay, now you've got to be sure here. If you, if you don't, you don't have to rush it. If you get an open shot, take it. Otherwise, you can take your time. Oh, McDonald tries to scoop shot. No good. 105 left to go in regulation. Tie score. Nothing but fours up there. Timeout, Medway. One minute to go in this ball game. 44-44. My favorite number. <laughs> and uh, here we go, Jay. We got another close barn burner here in the barn. Yep. Well, again, I will say this. You know, if you have the defense and you can play great defense, you're going to be in good shape. The other thing is you're going to have to do is shoot foul shots. Now, the next Harlison foul, Medway will be shooting two. They will no longer be in the number one, or one on one. They'll be in the double bonus. Um, Medway only has five fouls, so they're probably not going to see Holliston in the bonus that way. But uh, you use, use your defense, get you know, get the rebound, get the ball. No matter what they do, you can match it now because you're not behind. So if they go up, if they get a two, if they get a three, it doesn't matter. Well, uh, this is great, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Megan, you, you you had you had said originally that uh, you know these are two uh, closely matched teams, and they really are. And yeah. boy, it's really shown. And Meg, is, Megan is, Simpson has 19 points right now, yeah. and uh, you know just. Um, but see, that's from being a scorer. It, it, she's a shooter. I, I get it. She can do, but she's a scorer. She, she's getting 19 points, and it's it's done the hard way. It's done with layups. It's done with it. I, I don't even think she has a three tonight, does she? Uh, no, she doesn't. So, you know, she's getting layups. She's getting um, free throws. That's what a scorer does. They, they, they score all different ways. Okay, Midway inbound. I thought they were going to take that three right there. <laughs> See if they're trying to no, run down. No, I think Joe is a little more conservative. You know, I think he's going to go inside with the ball. There you go. Scoop shot Way by deep. two. The Quinzani with the rebound. It's ripped away. By Medway, scramble in the corner, and it's Holliston ball. Holliston ball out of bounds. Okay, first now, down. You've got 37.5 seconds left. Unless you have a layup, unless you have a layup, you're going to run this clock down to the end. You want to get the last shot. Now, obviously, if this, oh. the, the, you know, you might not. There might be a couple seconds left, but the shot clock's not reset. Yeah. Okay. Okay. There now they're working on it. Yeah. Okay. Thirty-five seconds. I was going to say I don't remember Holliston actually having the ball there. Now the other thing you can do, Holliston. I think they have at least one timeout left. This is where, as a coach, you can say, if you got the, if you got it, do it. But if not, we'll take it. Take take the time off the clock. Get it down to about, uh, you know, we 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 have uh, just a few seconds left on the shot clock, and then you can call another timeout and and uh, set something else up if you want. But um, you don't have to um, get the ball up right away. But if, if you've got yeah. the shot, you've got to take it. I mean, if, if we can use the 35 seconds. And score. You know, and score, that's the best thing. Yeah. Okay. Well, if you, if, you, if, you don't, if you use the 35 seconds and you don't score, well, they only have two seconds. You've got yep. you to defend but not foul. Right. You know, you just can't let them throw up that like that shot they right. had yep. earlier yep. i mean they're yep. capable of making that so you gotta at least uh present a problem in letting them pass the ball up you know uh you, and you gotta cover those shooters see and, and they're in a situation too where they have two fouls to waste oh actually one foul to waste and second second foul they'll be all gonna be shooting too well and hopefully uh they were told if you're going to get fouled, shoot it. <laughs> All right, McDonald gets it up over. Oh, dishes it yep, to uh, Williams. Okay. Yep. Okay, plenty now they got time. it to Megan. Plenty of time, plenty of time. Kuzani with the ball. Ooh. Into Brady. There oh, down is. low to Katie Williams. Oh, a shot block. is blocked. Oh, my goodness. That's uh, number 10. 
uh, Shannon Mejia. That was a great block by Mejia. What a great play. Plenty of time. With Holliston 17, ball. 17 seconds on the shot clock. Plenty of time. Well, Simpson through the middle. Shot is up. No good. Medway with the rebound. And, and he goes out of bounds. bounds. It's going to be Hollis now and Ball. Now you want to call a timeout, Coach. 9.6 seconds left. You want to call a timeout. Left. There you go. Nicely played. Nicely okay, played. Okay, nice call, Coach. So now what, now what you have is you get the last shot. So, again, um, unless there's a uh, layup there, you take it. They're not going to foul you. You know they're not going to foul you. So you can do whatever you want with the ball. And 9.6 seconds is plenty of time. You want to... Mess around for a couple seconds, and then about six or seven seconds left, that's when you go to the basket. And, the, and, and they want to go to the basket because yep. you want a chance to get fouled. Right. And, you know, if you can't put the ball in the hoop, at least you're going to go to the free throw line. And, and even if you miss and they get the rebound, there's not going to be enough time for them to get it down court. So what a game this has been. This hope, is great. We hope our audiences uh, has, have enjoyed this, all our Holliston folks and our Medway folks. and. Uh, well, I'll tell you what, if you haven't, it's too bad for you because I love this. I think this is great. <laughs> okay. We, uh, somebody must have called home and said, this is a great game because uh, our audience is getting left. bigger. Yeah. It's getting bigger. 9.6 seconds left. Okay, now we've got to be careful on inbounding this. We've got to make good cuts and seals. Mm -hmm. um, because you don't want Medway to steal this, and then you can't, you have trouble setting up your defense, you know? Right. They love to push the ball, so. Where do we, still has one timeout here, so if he can't get the ball in, he can call, the coach can call a timeout. They're going from just a little bit, not quite under the basket. Brady inbounds. Okay, Simpson with the ball. Now you can go. At, at any point now, you can go. Please go now. Oh, 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 step. Uh, okay. So we have a travel call. Clock runs out, and it's 44-44. Another awesome Holliston ball game here. I love this. These are four-minute uh, uh, overtimes, right, I believe? I thought they were. There yes, you there you yeah, go. Okay, minutes. yeah. All fours across the board. Four minutes, 44, 44. And uh, this is, oh, my God. This is overtime number three? Is it? Well, wait, wait, wait. Let me see. Did I mark it on there? Now, the foul situation oh. stays the same because uh, Holliton has nine fouls. So the next time they foul, it's a double bonus for uh, Medway. Uh, Medway only has five fouls, so Hollison, they got to foul Hollison a couple times before Hollison goes to the line. Yes, this is uh, overtime number three for Holliston. Uh, and let's see. They, didn't, we, they, didn't they play one down in the um, down in the tournament? Did they play down there? Was it North Attleboro? Was that an overtime? I don't think so. The, no. the scores don't look like they might no. be. Well, maybe, but um, they beat Dedham in overtime, 48-47. Yep. yep. And they beat Bellingham 40 to 37 oh, in, o okay. in overtime. Yeah. Okay, so. All right, here they, we go. Thanks to statistician Steve for that yeah. information. He's done a great job tonight. Okay, uh, Mia's going to jump against Bullard. Okay, extension of the fourth quarter, so the teams are going in the same direction as, that they've been going in. And there's the tap. Oh, oh Simpson it. steals the ball and heads right to the basket. Pitches to, to Quinzani. Okay. Take your time. Simpson with a jump shot. No good. Uh, Brady. Medway coming down the other way. Baseline drive oh, is nice good play. by uh, Ellie Copeland. Pretty play into Copeland. She was able to finish. Okay, Holliston working the ball. 
Simpson gets a nice pick, puts up a three. Oh! Almost. Almost there. Got to got to play some defense now because you don't want to get too many possessions behind here. There's a long oh, three. Long three. Oh, that's a killer. That's number 10, Shannon Mejia. Mejia. And Mejia's done that a couple times tonight now. You don't, have to, you don't have to match it. Just come down and score. There's, There's Kaylee. Kaylee in the middle. Shot is no good. She tries to steal the rebound. 49-44. 254 left to go in the first overtime. Okay, there's a shot. Okay, no good. Go. Uh, Katie Williams with the ball, and she's pushing it right up. Yeah, she's another really fast uh, guard for Holliston. Okay, Simpson into the middle with the runner. No good. Ooh, just off the hands of Mia. Medway with great the rebound. Oh, they had a leak out. Recovery. That's great recovery. That's a great foul and a great recovery by Kelly. She got down there. That was going to be a layup. And now you're going to make them just make the foul shots, yep. you know. And uh, You had to do that. That's, yep. that's her fourth. Ellie Copeland makes the first. 11 points for Ellie. She's a junior. Hits yeah. the front of the rim, Simpson with the rebound. See, that was worth it. The great hustle by Kaylee was worth it. Here comes Simpson. Ooh. Oh, Quinzani with the steal. Out to Katie Williams, the shot. In and out. Ooh, boy. Okay, Holliston pressing, and it's going to be midway ball. Uh, Simpson going to the floor, trying to get a piece of that ball. Okay, midway inbounds it. They go up the court. 2.06 to go. Holliston down by six. Oh, nice dish off. Oh, yes. Hollison, Hollison with the rebound. Nice. Megan Lyons rips that off the boards. Simpson pushes it up. Step through, and yep, she's going to get two. fouled on a two shot foul. Well, once again, you get the opportunity to score with no time running off the clock. So that's that's big for Hollison. Now they're down six with 151 left to go. And and that's uh, Medway's sixth foul. So they'll be one and one on any additional fouls. Simpson First. makes it. Okay, Katie Williams comes out. If, if Holliston wins this game by one, we'll wait after this. Nice here. If Holliston wins this game by one, Steve, that great play that Kaylee McDonald made down there. She wasn't really happy with it, but it was a tremendous play. There's a steal. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, Medway uh, ball. Medway yeah. ball. Yeah, I think that's right. But that great play by, by Kaylee to prevent the layup, foul the player, and the player only gets one of the two free throws. That's a big, big play right now in this ball game. Hollison down four. 143 left to go in the first overtime. Okay. They're using clock. We can't let them use too much clock here. Oh, what a nice underneath. Oh, nice block. Megan Lyons with the block. Here we go. McDonald now to Simpson. She goes down the middle. The shot is up. Oh, around the rim, no good. And we got a jump ball. That one should be Medway's ball, I believe. Yeah. Jump Mia Quinzani ties that one up. Another, another uh, hustle play on the boards there. Okay. 118 left to go. The first overtime. Good. This is what you want to do. Come down here and there we go. see if they make a mistake. Simpson goes for the steal. Can't get it. Medway pushes it up. Dishes. Oh, that's going to be Holliston ball. All right, you're getting the chances now. You're going to have to start taking advantage of these chances that you're getting. 107 left to go in the first overtime. All right, got to put it in the, in the basket. Got to come away with points this time. Okay. Uh, Ellie Copeland is all over Megan Simpson. There's the inlet. 
Okay, over to Brady. Underneath. And there's the leak out. Oh, wow. Time out. Time out. <laughs> yeah, time out by Medway. 42.8 seconds left. So, would you have called time out or let her go for the potential layup? Or would, probably would, gotten fouled. I think I would have called time out and talked to her and said, don't go for the layup. <laughs> Pull out. The clock is our friend. Well, this is true, too. You know, and then the other thing is, the only thing Hollison can do is foul. And if they foul, they're shooting two, two shots. They're up fourth. So that would put them up two possessions. They're already up two possessions, so... So, it, what a ball game this has oh, been. Uh, Katie really, Williams really is checking back into the game. Uh, Hollison with the block shots, with the, the rebounds and everything. But I'll tell you what, that Medway team is really doing a nice job coming out there and, and uh, doing a nice job shooting. And they have some really good interior passing. They oh, yeah. They really do. And they can finish around the basket. They're going to be fun to watch the next they couple really years. This are. whole league is going to be fun. Yeah. A lot of sophomores. Hollison starts two sophomores. Yeah. Hollison know. starts two. And you know what? The, the third one is going to be LB. You know, Lucy, she's, she's going to be there next year, too. And she's going to be another one who I think next year she might be that second really good scorer that you really, really need. And then, the other, of course, a lot of the other girls are, you know, here coming back. And Megan Lyons and bunch of those girls. Oh, yeah. Okay, so uh, Coach brought in Katie Williams uh, for Caroline Brady, so I think he's looking to get another shooter in the game uh, because they're going to need some points here. Okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> there you go. Unfortunately, that's the one you probably don't want to foul. But yes. There's probably three of them out there you don't want to foul, but you never know. All right, Victoria you Bullard. You really have no, no choice, though. You have to, uh, you really do have to foul. Shooting two. She's got eight points right now. Make it so nine. Smooth. Yeah. She's going to very be a very uh, wow. look at that right in just perfect form. Here comes Megan. You're going to have to take threes now. Yeah, and, and they're staying right on her. There's the nice there pick. Yeah. Oh, blocked. So is that bullet that came out? Okay, got to got to get her. Yeah. Okay, and there's up. Uh, that's going to be the fifth foul on Katie Williams. Okay, okay. You're, you're getting uh, Lucy Bauman comes Lucy in. and she's your other three-point shooter. 23.9 seconds, and we've got Shannon Mejia at the free throw line. This is the first. Well, that's a little help. You've got to get. You've got to get this now. She's a senior, and she makes it. Yeah, now it's. Three possession. Who called the timeout there? Was that Medway? Yeah, timeout Medway. All right, three okay. possessions. So you can either go for two or three right here and foul quickly. Yeah, and this is, you know, what's tough is, you know, when, when you gave up that first hoop, you were down two. You know, in overtime, you really got to match them. You, you do. You know. It, it, it's, it's, a, it's a possessions um, situation when you get when you get close to the end of a game or you get into overtime like that it's it's not really points it's more possessions and now like I said when you when you're down six you want to shoot two threes when you're down seven now you come back to you're going to have to possess the ball three times uh, you can go for two and you can actually go for two a couple of times if you want and then try and hit the three at the end of the game and ideally what well, you know if we could have Megan come off of a screen. And you open for a three, and you yeah. pitch the ball to her. Mm -hmm. You know she's more likely to maybe make, uh, to make the fouled. three. And well, but she's not going to be doubled if right. she's dribbling. Right. You know they're all running at her. Well, the, co the coach Ioni is telling his team no fouls. 
Coach Amendo and his talented team, they're not going to foul you. So yeah. if you get a quick shot, get that quick shot. Get it, take it quickly. And you may see Megan doubled all over right now. Yep. You know, they may leave somebody open. Oh, Caroline Brady is back in. I, li I like the idea of pressing in this situation. I really do. You, you, you extend the, make the clock go. Oh, boy. Ooh. The interception by Medway on the yeah. inbound. Um, you know, uh, boy, uh, she's everywhere. She's done a nice job tonight. Yeah, yeah. Um, Megan, you know, when he, when she saw the defense, she tried to run to open space, yep. and the pass just didn't get up. And makes the first. Well, still three possession. But now you're going to make some threes. And this is Quinzani rebounds. Megan. There it is. She goes for the long three where she's open. Uh, Lions yeah, valiant effort trying to save that ball. 12 seconds left. That, that'll, that'll be it. What a great game, though, by two young teams. Two talented teams and uh, great defense, and great offense by both teams. Final yep. score, Medway 54, Hollison 46. How's statistician Steve doing over here? He's doing great. Okay, so we got some scores for you. Hopefully they're not always right, so uh, <laughs> don't use them as official. But we've got uh, Olivia Canary with two points. We have uh, Olivia Melanson with 11 points. Anna Friedman with four points. Shannon Mejia with oop, two, three, five, seven, 10, 11, 12. Sorry about that. 12 points, all in the second half. <laughs> okay, Victoria Bullard uh, with nine points. Ellie Copeland with 11 points. Regan Longball with four points. On the Hollison side of the ledger, we have Mia Quinzani with three points. Caroline Brady with eight points. Lucy Bauman with four points. Ava St. John with six points. Katie Williams with two points. Megan Lyons with two points. And Megan Simpson with 21 points. She's right on her average there, and it was nice to see some other scoring for some other people. I want to thank um, uh, Tom Harmon, our Tom Harmon, not the Tom Harmon who won the Heisman, our Tom Harmon. Uh, and uh, he, he's doing the, uh, the computer stuff tonight. And um, look up, hey, how you doing? And Bruce Guilfoy up high above courtside. Steve, nice job tonight. You brought us all the way home. And uh, that'll be it from the Rolls Fieldhouse final score. Final score was in overtime, Medway 54, Holliston 46. Good night, everyone. Good night now.